Hey there, it's Sunday, so it's time for what? Sparamantin, that's right. So today, I'm gonna to show you something really fun that I started doing on Friday. I stripped up some newspapers, and they're all equally um, sliced up. I used a knife to do that, not scissors, it's much faster. And I'm just gonna wet lightly a couple of pieces. And I have my trusty drill here, and it's set to forward. And I will like to, I do want to say right now that no safety glasses are required for this project. Thank you, Trent. Okay, so Trent's a friend of mine from high school who saw my bookcase construction um, photographs. Said, Where's the safety glasses? Actually, I am wearing glasses right now, but you can't see me uh, wearing them. Okay, so. I'm on a forward motion on this, and I'm just gonna hit the button and hold it. And you learn when is the time to stop. Right now is the time to stop. This has all been coiled. Now I'm going to fold it in half, take the clip off, the, the uh, clothespin, and flick the button to go in the other direction and let it spin a little bit and then take it off the drill and what I have here looks like yarn it actually is newspaper yarn let's do another one okay so this has been lightly dampened with water I'm going to use the clothespin make sure my drill is going forward and let it rip And stop. Fold this over. Make it so both ends are clipped to the drill. Click it to go in reverse. And hit it on the go. And what do we have? We have another piece of newspaper yarn. Now, I did try an espelment at Open Studio on Friday with the help of my friend Carol. And I had glued with a glue stick the ends of the papers together. And I did, well, an entire sheet of newspaper was probably 24 feet. And used the drill there, and it didn't work that well. Because it just doesn't. It's much easier to do these shorter strips, and then you could weave them together. Or maybe use them with the ends like that. So what am I going to do with this stuff? I don't know. I know that in November we have Recycle Week, and um, maybe I'll do a project with newspaper. I work a lot in paper mache, so this will probably be added to something that I've already created the form for. Maybe an animal, maybe a vegetable, maybe a mineral. I don't know. So that is the Sunday Sparrowment, and it's okay to try this at home. Okay? Uh, ciao for now, and... Flora says hi. In fact, Flora says a lot. In fact, in fact, I'm probably going to get yelled at right now because she's not in the studio, right?